Now let's listen to something that I think is serious business. Here is a tape which we here have boosted the sound so you can hear something that this guy Zerman says under his breath. It sounds to me, I'm listening to it a couple of times, like the F word, which we don't speak on television, and another word which is clearly recognizable to anyone watching right now as a racial slur. Let's listen to the tape. Okay, which entrance is that that he's heading towards? The back entrance. Are you following him? Yeah. Okay, we don't need you to do that. Well, we cut it off there. I don't know why we cut it off there. Yeah, I, I, I have listened to the enhanced version of the tape. We, we, for whatever reason, it was cut off here. But if you, if you no, listen, it was apparently there. Well, it, was, it was there. It was in the initial part where he, he's whispering on his breath. Obviously, it sounds like he's moving. Ethan. Yeah. And I'm going to say it, Dill. I don't think we should hide it. The, the American public needs to know. If you listen to that tape, he says effing coon under his breath. That yeah, is a racial slur. Yeah, I heard that when I was back in the you, studio. You, yeah. It is unmistakable. It is undeniable. If you listen to, uh, undeniable if you listen to the enhanced version, that in and of itself makes it a hate crime. That's why the Justice Department is involved. It's why the FBI is going to have to investigate this case. And if state authorities um, do not prosecute and properly investigate this, we will see a prosecution, I believe, under the federal hate crime legislation.